edge. Now you can leave. Mills! Do you know how hard I worked? I shall gladly take whatever punishment you feel is adequate once we return. But, Princess, I beseech you to withhold your anger for just a moment. How dare you stand in the way of Princess Jorette of Serendia? If we were not out in the field, you would have been severely punished. What would compel you to ask such an obvious thing? Did Eden originally hire you on as a mercenary? Do you not know the ancient chamber excavation site is directly under the command of Princess Jurette? We told Eden how important this site is, yet he dares to bring in someone so wet behind the ears. He's making it quite hard to trust him as a leader. We'll be lucky if we find anything at all before the deadline. Eden was handpicked by our eminent Lord Jordan. Do you doubt the Grand Chamberlain of Serendia's shrewdness? I sincerely apologize, Princess. That was not what I meant when I said those words. I shall punish you for your suspicions in time. For now, just concern yourself with how to restore his honor. Yes, I shall give this new recruit a fitting task. Fortune truly favors you. Follow me. Ruin's excavation starts with picking up a pickaxe. Break the stones around that ruin and fill the cart. It's a simple task. So go to the soldier below once you are done. But, I will say this once, overconfidence is a fool's folly. Eden's strong new recruit finally arrived, I see. Now tell us, how did you get locked in the sights of that spoiled princess? Oh, never mind. You didn't hear me say a thing. Anyways, it seems like you know how to handle yourself. Follow me. Do you see those hungry wolves stalking about in the grass? The horses won't budge thanks to that scary lot. Sir Roig may appear like he's not watching, but he sees all. So this is the time to show your stuff, my friend. Weren't you an excavator? I thought you'd get eaten live. But it seems you've some use. I'll grant you access to the ancient stone chamber. Go and help Eden finish up with the excavation. <laughs> 